what is going on everybody thank you for clicking the link this is your boy crisis 20 guys i'm going to talk about the new xbox update that is coming out primarily about the looking for group and clubs all right so that's what i'm going to talk about so let's get it started as i said before this is only for xbox preview members if you guys go to community and underneath trending on Xbox, you'll see clubs on Xbox. So this will get you into the clubs. Right now we are viewing public clubs. Anybody that has created a public club will appear here. Uh, and it'll go by the games that you've played recently. So Destiny, Battlefield, Tom Clancy, and either Xbox's official uh, um, Xbox clubs. All right, so that's what you're looking at there. Um, this is my club for Destiny, and I'll get to that in a little bit. But first, let's go ahead and uh, let's create a club. So you have three different type of clubs. You have a public club, you have a private club, and you have a hidden club. The public clubs and the private clubs are together, so you can only create three of these all right so they're combined so you have up to three to choose from between public and private all right uh hidden clubs you have up to a hundred so i'm assuming if you have a clan or anything like that you create one and invite everybody to that clan all right so i think that's pretty much what the hidden ones are for um so you have a hundred of those so let's just create public club so you're gonna go ahead change your club okay okay uh, name my club okay so uh, now it's ready to create my public club and this is where if I want to create it I can go ahead and create it I'm not gonna create the club but it's just for this purpose as of right now so once you create the club um, it's going to look something like this all right so you can add your own tags to the club make a description for your club and add the games you want to the club all right so let's go in detail here so as you can see you have communications play style and you have people all right so you can choose out of these options which i think is so cool because in the beginning of your club you can let people know like hey if you have a mic or if you need a mic you know go ahead and you know choose that option uh, if swearing is okay not swearing trash talking or no trash talking basically you're differentiating yourself between a kid or an adult now you have your play style all right you can choose what play style you got you uh, are interested in so these are the ones that I chose for my uh, for my club and for people you have these options here to differentiate between if you're a kid or an adult so I think this is so cool right there. I really like that. You can add your description here and you can choose what game you want as well. You have up to 10 games within a club. So go ahead and, you know, choose whatever game. And then when you're done, just hit done. Um, all right. So you can change your profile pic. You can go ahead and change your profile pic to whatever you want it to be. And you know, it's the same pictures as you choose from when you're creating um, your user account. Change your color, same as if you're doing your user account. And you can add a background image. So all your achievements that you've done within the game, you can go ahead and, uh, and add them. And it also come with the the emblem at the bottom there. So all those emblems it comes with that you see there. You can invite people to the club. So you have up to a thousand. So you can invite to your heart's content. It only looks like it does people from your friends list. It doesn't do recent players or anything like that from what I know of. Maybe they might change this later, but for right now, this is just strictly to your friend list. When you are added to a club, you automatically follow it. 
but you can join other clubs so it's not like you're limited to one i don't know how many clubs you can join but um you can unfollow or follow that club if you like and then obviously you can report the club as well you have the looking for group option within the club itself so um i'll get in more detail to that later um then you have the feed in their club so if anybody posts anything you know you'll see it here then you have your roster so this basically says who's online yada yada then you can manage your club you can accept an invitation request and recommendations here so if anybody recommended anybody from your members it'll appear here you can re you can look at your reports and there are no reports obviously members and admins so right now within your members you can choose what actions you want you can ban remove member or promote to admin and then you know obviously you can invite someone and you can filter uh, between your members and stuff like that here and in the settings uh basically you got public settings here let people ask to join the club or you could just let them join on their own who can invite people to the club you know you can choose whoever um got looking for group what they can do there who can chat an activity feed so yeah so that's the settings of the club all right so that is that so now let's go to the looking for group feature so if you go on your left hand side here actually let me leave the party so this is what it's gonna look like um, so if you go to looking for group choose the which game you want right now you're looking at all the looking for groups that people have created within the Xbox so everybody that's here basically needs help so let's go ahead and create a post so again you're gonna see ad tags and descriptions just like how you've seen with the clubs but you can get a little bit more in depth you still have your same Xbox tags which is your communication play style and people but you can add a custom tag so you can add your own tag it could be a hashtag um, I've tried using this feature um, I don't know if it's a glitch but when I finished my own tag it didn't add it uh, I don't know why but uh, not 100% sure why it wouldn't add it but um, these are the popular uh, hashtags that are within the game so you can choose whatever you're looking for nightfall you know destiny taking king if you're looking to raid you can put all these hashtags here they got a lot of different ones you could choose from and then on top of that you can add your achievements you're trying to look for which is also cool I really like this part choose what achievements you're trying to go for within the game all right and then you can add them all right up here like that and then add a description now when you're on the right hand side here you can choose how many people you're looking for obviously this will depend per game but if you're in a fire team uh you just want to choose two yourself is excluded so you want to just cho choose two people that you need um even if you choose two and then you have two in your and you're looking for group you can still accept more people to your looking for group so that's just a fyi but you have up to 15 people to add to the looking for group okay so when you're done you just post
all right so there's my post there and as you can see it says I need one because I chose one so if you have people in your party it'll show so it'll say have and it'll show whoever's looking in your post it'll show how many people that's already inside of the looking for group so once you click the looking for group you'll see interested here basically anybody that's interested in your post they will click they're interested so once you click it a notification will pop up and say hey somebody is interested in your group so you will go here and their name would appear here and you can confirm or reject their re their invitation once they you once you confirm it they'll appear below down here once you have the people you need you then hit gather your party and it'll pull everybody into your party so if you uh, go to your party here it's gonna look like this it'll show the text within the party you can invite people to the party things like that but it still stays within your looking for group it doesn't depart from your looking for group so when you're done you could just hit cancel post and that is it it'll cancel the post yep it canceled and but your but your party still exists um and obviously um i'm done with this party so i'm just leave the party now let's just say i want to join his oh he probably just his probably is over so let's just say i click his name here all right, so he has this. So you can click I'm interested or report this post, things like that. So once you click I'm interested, it's going to send that request to that person. So that's pretty much the uh, the looking for group side. Let me go back to the clubs for a minute. So inside of your club, you can create a uh, you can create your own party with within the club all right you could create your own party within the club and then on top of that you can do the looking for group all right and then choose which game and do it right from there so this gives you like an easier way to do looking for group within your club so that's pretty cool as well make it faster and easier um same rules apply but yeah but you know pretty much that's uh that's about it guys that is the looking for group and the clubs in its entirety if you guys are xbox preview members and you're looking to get back into destiny or you are in destiny waiting for rise of iron guys go ahead and invite yourself to my club all right and i'll be more than happy to accept you i hope you liked it because i tried to go in depth and try to make you guys get a full understanding of this as opposed to all the other videos that really doesn't give a full example of what you're getting into so i hope you guys like what i'm trying to do and go ahead and like and subscribe guys because um if they do come out with more stuff i will definitely go ahead and uh do some more videos about it so guys thanks for watching this is your boy Crisis, and I'll catch you guys at another step-by-step -step tutorial. Peace.